Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, you're watching Chips Challenge 2, their first assignment, and today we're starting with yet another Joshua Bone level, Caverns, or as my little brother would have pronounced it when he was a kid, Caverns. So let's see, we've got multiple areas here to venture into with very, oh, there's a line of ants marching one by one, not so hurrah, actually. Um, boy, that teeth, the teeth are on the trail. Bummer. Yeah, that's gonna be a hard key to get without some kind of assistance. So let's try another. Let's try another way in first. Well, maybe there is no other way in first. Maybe I should not walk around the exact perimeter of the. Oh, oh gosh, it's not looking like there's much of a way in except through where we were just mentioning here. Uh, and yes, I'm gonna have to be. Yeah, there's only one way in, and that's around the teeth. And they are quite fast, those teeth. Okay, well, I've got him out of there at least. That was trickier than it looked. Okay, let's just leave all of you in the dust, literally. And okay, so there's only going to be one gap through here. Oh gosh, and that gap does not stay open for very long. So it's a series of twitch reflexes, maybe, this, this particular level, okay? All right, there's at least an opportunity for a chip here. We can get one of the, one of the few. Ah, there we go. Okay, that wasn't so hard. Um, what do we want to do here? We got flippers. Bummer. Oh God, see that's mean. Why would you put, why would you put it under the fire like that? And now I feel like I got to test the other one too, just to make sure. Wow, that. Mm. Woo, golly, those teeth feel particularly vicious. Okay, so now we have to do this whole shenanigan bit again. It wasn't too bad though. You just had to go at the right time, but there's plenty of opportunities to mess it up even if you're even if you've got it going pretty well. Oh gosh. See, he's in there in the corner with that thing. I don't want to mess around with that. Now they're all in the corner. Should I come back later? Is there a time that would maybe be better for you, Mr. Walker man? Oh gosh, that was why did I? And now, okay, well, maybe if we push this aside and do this. Bummer. Okay, same deal. I, I kind of figured, but I had to try it, you know? All right, now that we've got the flippers, we should be able to go back here and just swim through here to the green key. Made it just in time to have to wait a full cycle. That's, whoo boy, that felt closer than it had to be. Okay, so now that we've got the green key, uh, what, is that, what does that mean for us? I think that means we can move forward, actually, go here okay all right so what does he do now he does go in that little space right there so i have to get right behind him there's not much room for error there oh man got a fast little fast little tooth man here okay so if i okay and there's a and there's a thin wall right there as well can i just Bummer. nope he's too fast for me dang it do I have to have something special to get that one, or is that just another timing deal? So what happens now? Let's, okay, so we go on this side. Okay, either way, do we have to find a way to pick these up? Yeah, we might have to do that to get the teeth to leave us alone. In fact, I bet we have to do it in order to maybe put the teeth right here or something, or in another spot. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy, that's a... That's a confusing little run of stuff you got going on there. Oh my gosh. Oh boy, this this hurts the old brain. Although that could be the amount of caffeine I've had today. Okay, let's run and gun it. Okay, uh, now I'm not exactly sure. Okay, wasn't exactly sure how to get out of there for a second. Ants seem a little slower, a little easier to outrun. Uh, think before you speak, Jess. Oh boy. Yeah, boy, these are some kind of real optical illusions you got going here. Okay, yeah, so you have to kind of go between... Yeah. Okay. I know I skipped that one bit right now, but oh, hey. Okay, so I kind of have to... I feel like... Okay, what's the way to... What's the way to get... I skipped that chip down there a long time ago. And I feel like that's going to bite me now, because I think maybe I have to figure out some way to pick up that teleporter, so that I can... Oh, wait, 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 okay. Oh, it may be too late to go back now. I think I see now that he's on the left side of it. 
I think I might be... I think I might need to lure him onto the left side of that wall so that I can just get the chip safely. He'll face me, and then... Okay, so if I go up here... Yeah, okay. Just a little twisty corridor there. Okay. Just kind of fool him into chasing me around. Okay, yeah, only one chip left, and it's the one that I got... Oh! Well, there's time to go back through the maze, though, actually. That's kind of nice. Okay, so anything I picked up that I missed, that I thought I might need extra stuff for, I'm doing totally okay here. Okay, alright, alright, so now it's a big backtrack. I see what's going on here, and I... Ooh, boy, ooh, I'm not a fan of this part. Okay, find the gaps. You just gotta find the gaps. There we go. You gotta find the gaps, and you gotta mind the gaps. Okay, so now we go over here, and we... Can we get him to... Okay. Alright. So we have to move fast enough, I think. Is there a reason we're given the yellow teleporters here? I feel like I should be able to pick them up somehow, but... Okay, no, he just followed me straight over here, so... Ah, there we go. I fooled him with... Okay, I don't have to pick up the teleporters at all. I have all the chips, and as long as I can make it back safely, I should be okay. And I don't see why I wouldn't be able to do that, because we should be safely out of harm's way now. Alright, a little enclosed, ensorcelled area of challenges, but it wasn't such a bad one. It just required some, uh, some good timing. Very hard level to look at. Uh, but I didn't mind that one, mostly on account of the fact that it, it didn't take too many tries. The longer it would have taken, the more I would have gotten annoyed with its particular brand of trial after trial after trial. Moving on now to The Village. Not one of my favorite C. Scott Shyamalan movies, actually. But it looks like I have to control Chip. Okay, do I have to save all of them? It would seem to be the case. So this is the one where you can switch between them, correct? No, okay. Oh boy, okay, so... Let's see who I'm controlling here. First I have to get the red key. Okay, so... Alright. I have to control... Okay, I have to control a bunch of chips here. Okay, um... Alright, so now... Oh, no, I didn't mean to let that chip out that way. But this is... Okay, so I have... I have kind of infinite chips to work with here. Oh, and I have to turn off that jet up there as well. That fire jet up there as well. Oh, there's lots of stuff going on here. So I have five chip clones. And I don't have very long to do this either. Uh, big yikes. Uh, looks like I might need to... Oh, I need fire boots. There's no turning off that jet. I just need to... Okay, so what's the what's the score here? Let's go ahead and... Uh, okay, well, oh boy, that killed a bunch of them right off the bat. That's no good. Okay, that opens that up. But then what about the... Okay, we're going to be getting the flippers last, maybe? What's the order of operations here? That's the first thing to figure out. Okay, um... Maybe... Maybe focus on getting some fire boots first. How many... Boy, we kill a lot... We kill all but two chimps doing this. Okay, but one of them is, uh, well-equipped just enough. Okay, there we go. Alright. Uh... Okay, there we go. And now he's out. Okay, maybe two of them will be able to handle themselves. Uh, so we have, what do we have now? We have one chip that can use fire boots, and we have a, we have a key. Which key was that? Was it the blue key? Which key was that? Was it the, maybe it was the green key? No? No, it was the red key. What am I doing? Okay, there we go. He has the, he has the goods. Okay, so we want him to, okay, that's not what we wanted then. Okay, we got to figure out how to work these guys around so that they work together and do everything to get Chip out of the toggle gates. This is gonna be uh, this is gonna be a neat one, I think, but also a tricky one. All right, let's cram a few of these guys together. 
try getting them out. Okay, we need the fire boots. That kills all but two of them. Can we do it that way? So this one has the fire boots. So we're gonna take him upstairs. There we go. Get him out. He takes... Actually, let's leave this one over here for now. He's way far away out of the way. He's got the blue key, get the green key. Okay, so now the main ship needs to be the one that survives. So the main ship needs the flippers to get to the exit. So I'm going to take this one over here. All right, I'm going to open that up. We're going to leave that ship over on the left. We're going to leave him mostly behind blocks. All right. I think we can mostly do without him now. Okay. Yeah, I think we can I think we can do with having one left now. Because what I think we need to do Okay, so now we kind of need to manipulate him around. And how do I want to do that? I think I need him one more space over. There we go. So that when I get this, he goes on here and lets me off, and I win. Okay, that one's not so bad. I really like that one. That one, you gotta manipulate those chips into doing what you want. The Chip McCallahans, not the Chip Chips. A lot of the levels in this game actually don't have Chip Chips. But I really liked the way that one worked out. I think there's maybe even probably several ways you can get away with doing that one. And I didn't do anything as usual that involves getting any bonus points, but I'm not too concerned about that. I'm concerned about cutting through levels, making my way through. Turning point, another C. Scott Davis level. What's our hint today? To everything there is a season. We must turn, turn, turn. Uh, I think what they want me to do here is... Hmm, what do they want me to do here? Okay. Alright, get that going. All right. Oh, it reversed its uh, it reversed its direction. You can do that. You can reverse the direction of those things. Okay, that's pretty wild. I didn't know you could do that. That you could actually. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Daddy made an oopsie. That's no good. Okay. So let me let me kind of wrap my head around this again. This is facing left and right, and it's still facing left and right. But when I put it on the railroad junction. It switches its direction? Really? That's a legal move? That's pretty fascinating, actually. Okay, so what... Now Now that we have the big wide world available to us, we need to figure out what is a legal move. These are all... These are all going to kill me if I don't do something about this. I need to turn that on, which involves needing a blue key. Where is the blue key, first of all? Okay, so there's the blue key. It's on the water. I need to get... I need to get into the water somehow. Oh, here we go. I need to start turning blocks. Okay. All right. So if I go... Okay, time to mess around with this some. If I go here... Okay, yes, it will change the direction of things. I do believe. Okay, so if I go here and down... There we go. But I can also go this way and down. Oh, hey, all right, okay, that's very good. So now I should be able to pop this. I love running these things along the railroad track. That's actually a really interesting mechanic. Uh, and then I think I want to take it this way. Yeah, there we go. Wow! That's really fascinating how you can do that. That's, that's pretty spectacular, actually. Okay, so now, how do we want to do this? We probably want to take this in here. Alright, yeah, so we want to come over here now, I bet, so that we can... Alright, we're going to be putting... We're going to be putting these... Okay, so that's going to leave that going uh, this way. Let's... Okay, we've got to get all of these into a corner. Uh, and I think I can do this one here. What am I doing by... I need to know what I'm doing, first of all. I know there's a time limit, and I know that it's probably going to... Okay. Well, actually, now I'm really interested in... Okay. 
All right. So I get here. All right. So then I hit this. And it allows me to get out of here. I got myself stuck, didn't I? I needed to be open on that. So, oh, dang. Okay. I needed to be... I needed to get through this and then come up here and then immediately step onto this so that it would stay put here when I needed it to. Okay, alright. But I do love the logic of the level so far. It is... Oh, man. This is going to be a super fun one to work out. Okay, so let's see how that bears out this time. I go this way and I got to be really quick. There we go. Okay, and that keeps that there so that I can get back to here and go get this blue key, and then I'll just be bumped back. Yes, I just have to stand on the logic thing long enough to... Okay, so now I have a blue key for here. But was that the key to collect yet, though? That may have been... That may have been folly, because I need to go through here. This might be the next place to go, because... Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and see if there are any other blue keys. And if there aren't, I'm going to open up that door. So that the thief can't... No, I don't think there are any other blue keys to collect. So I'm just going to go ahead and get that. While I can. Alright, so there we go. And the next idea will be to get this one opened up. So that... Okay, where is this one emanating from? Right here, down in the corner. So I should just be able to take any old block and do that one. So let's go ahead and... Do that. This one just goes down in the corner. And I don't want the thief to take anything from me. Okay, yeah, they all destroyed themselves. Yay. And then I get this. Okay, and I never have to deal with this room again. So I have, don't have to worry about the threat of keys being taken from me. Alright, so now... Now I want to take this one over here. Which means I can push it up and to the left. So I'm going to take that one here. Why don't I just get the rest of these sorted out while I'm able? Okay, so this one goes here. Um, how about, what does this one do? That Now it's down and to the left. Now it's down and to the right. Yeah, I got myself stuck again because I'm going to need to figure out which block goes up here. Oh, is that a thing? Like, do I need a block to go up there? I imagine I do. I, I imagine I need a permanent block going up. Maybe I don't. Okay. And then maybe I can just, uh... Well, they all pop themselves into place. The whole... Maybe the whole idea is they keep... I probably have to have a block on this permanently, don't I? And I should probably... Yeah, I don't see how anything is changing up there. I probably should sort out how all these blocks are supposed to go into place before I start running around and doing things. Because I have effectively blocked off my chances of getting that red key but uh, how's the okay now i can go in here safely though that's good to know um okay how about i how about i push this to the which one do i want to push probably this one right and then i get this one yeah uh nope i'm gonna get myself <laughs> stuck in here doing that well, I got myself good and stuck anyway, because I failed to solve the puzzle. Ha! 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 Okay. One thing I think I need to sort out first is the killing of the teeth to get these chips. I think what I want to do is push this in here, and that'll allow them to come around and kill me as they see fit. Or they think they're coming to kill me, but, uh... Yeah, they're just coming in here. Bummer. What? How did that work? Okay, come on. Come on now. We want to do this the right way. The way that doesn't get me eaten by teeth. We want to do... Okay, yeah. So, come on in. Come on in and, and get me, fellas. Wait. Did I just play myself? Yeah, I think I kind of did. Uh, and now I can't get back in there. Uh, what am I... Okay, I had this for just a second. What am I doing? You are not thinking, Jess. Come on. Use that head for something something other than a hat rack, why don't you? Okay, so let's come on out here. Okay, yeah, now they should all come through. Now they should all come through here and be trying to kill me and not really... 
succeeding. Okay, yeah. So most of them get through, except for I think like none of them. Okay, yeah, that's good. Okay, so yeah, now I have those five chips and I can kind of go about the rest of the level now. Okay, there it is. I have every gate open now. All right, very good. Which means I can do this as prescribed. Well, I want to go get that blue key first. That's the most important one, I think. So what we want now is to... Yes, now we can get this red key, which I had misbegottenly not gotten before. And now I can go in here. Those are the final chips. There we go. Now it's just a matter of getting out of here in a fashion. And I think what I want to do actually is, I think I pushed the one above me last time. I think I want to go for this one. Yeah, there we go. So that I hit up. I thought that would just cause me to turn around. Is that not what it does? Great, wonderful. Good, great, grand, wonderful. No yelling at Chip's challenge. Ah, my old nemesis, simple puzzles. Well, let's try it this way. How about we go here and, you know, maybe actually make use of this little nook that they give you. So, all right, we've got the whole stoplight full of keys. So now we can go to the exit. We only have one obstacle left. We can still screw it up. Don't worry. I've got to make it to the exit now. I'm going to go in here. And I think I've got to go around to this side and get it up onto the button. So here we go. Yay! All right, and I'm through the socket and pop, pop, pop. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, I still like that level all the same. It did take a lot of sorting out. There are a lot of individual... You know what? I'm even past wanting a midpoint for Chips Challenge levels at this point. I would just like an undo button. If you could take back even just one little mistake, it would save so much time and frustration and wasted energy. An undo button. Everybody makes mistakes. That's why pencils have erasers. 